Hey guys, so in this video, I'll be showing you how to build a hotel booking system using the hotel booking plugin by Motopress. So keep in mind that you will need the premium version of this plugin in order to accept bookings, but I'll be showing you how to go over the infrastructure, which you can set up using their free plugin. So if this is something you'd like to learn how to do, then watch this video. Okay, so here I have a fresh install of WordPress. So what we want to do first is install a theme that will build that will give us a good foundation to our Airbnb clone. So what you wanna do here is go into appearances and themes. Okay, so if we search Airbnb here, we can use this theme over here. So now the theme is installed, next we want to activate. Okay, great, so we have like a good foundation for the theme, so now let's install the plugin. So go into plugins. Okay, so we're gonna search rent. Okay, so we'll install this one over here, Hotel Booking Light, and click Install. And then Activate. Okay, and then we're just inst we'll install the recommended plugins here as well. Okay, so now that's working. And then install the other required plugin. Okay, great. And then now we can activate and then install the pages here for the hotel booking plugin. Okay, so just go back to the dashboard. Okay, and then over here we can go into our bookings. Okay, now over here looking into settings, what we want to do is configure the plugin first. Okay, so over here, what you want to do in accommodation is go into settings. Okay, so they have all the checkout pages here already set up. Okay, so let's see what we need to adjust here. So you can put in your country code. And then automatically creating the user accounts. And we'll enable these. Okay, and then you can just enable the options which apply to your booking policies. Okay, and then currencies over here is important. So I just change this to Canadian dollars. And then the metric system that you're using. Okay, great. So this is good. So save changes. Okay, so now we're gonna add an accommodation. So let's add, so we'll add a house. So let's say a house. Okay, so this is more for a hotel. So let's just revise this to say basic room. Okay, and then how many people can stay? So say two adults, two children, capacity, say four view okay so you can put in what you can see so you can see the seaside and then the bed type say queen king and then room service so let's say available service add new service so we can just say room service Okay, and then you can just add the price and how many times. So let's just say uh, breakfast service, breakfast buffet. Okay, so let's say it's 100 and once per guest. Let's put $10. Okay, and publish that. Okay, and then back in our accommodation, we can add our available services. So let's publish this first. Okay, and then we can add our additional service, so update. And then over here, you can add in some categories for the room, some tags and, the, and amenities, and then 
the photo galleries are over here and there's also a rating system as well. Okay, so let's view the post for a basic room. Awesome, so you're able to make the booking here as well. So let me just add in a picture as well, just to make it, just to see the detailed layout. So I'll just add in an image, so customize, edit accommodation type. Okay, and then add this as the featured image. Okay, and then add this in the gallery as well. Okay, and then update and let's view the posts. Awesome, so the image is here and then this is the gallery. So if you click on it, it opens up to a full screen image. Let's finish off here by adding the links in the main menu. So go here into menu. Okay, and then up here is our main menu. So let's add that to the theme. So go here into customize. Okay, and then click to add menu up here. Okay, the primary menu. So let's just create the menu. Okay, and publish that. And then we'll just go and add in the links here. So we'll do home, my account, and accommodations. Okay, and then click that. And let's go back to our home page. Okay, great. So now we have our account page here. Okay, so you can see your bookings over here on the side and then accommodations here. Okay, so we have here is a basic room. So we can view the details here and then you can make a booking. So in order to enable bookings, you'll have to upgrade to the premium version over here. So if you go to premium, they do have a free trial so you can test it out. So if you click here, you can see the free trial. And then if you want to go premium, the pricing here is 139 per site. So if you're looking for a robust plugin that allows you to make online bookings, then you can check out the Hotel Booking Premium Plugin by Motopress. So this concludes the end of the video. I hope you were able to follow along and have an idea of how to set up a hotel booking system. If you would like help with setting up a booking system for your business, then you can check out my website, maplitmedia.ca. Please like and subscribe for more content like this, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks.